Hi students, this is Alex here. One of the center of excellence industrial robot in charge goda irko, Mr. Sridhar sir. Hello sir. Hi sir. Sir, ipo Savita Engineering College la enna na robots la arke and enna robotic trainings la students ko kudu kringa. Savita Engineering College orda number robotic segment la rende categorization achi irko. One na mande industrial robotics abhi inte dikna us specialized lab irko. Mobile robotics abhi na adhiko specialized lab irko. So I am associated with the industrial robotics lab. So on the industrial robotics lab, what is our problem? So usually, all robotics in our world, they have a robot. So what we do is industrial co-bot. So industrial collaborative robot. So in the world, we know that it is a collaborative nature. So a human and a machine are the same work. Now, in the present generation, we can interact with a machine and humans. So in the robot, it has all the sensors embedded. So a human is also working. So when we are working, we can do any accident or any accident. So we can do any damage to human. So the robot can do any components. So the robot is highly sensor equipped. So that's why we are co-bottom. So in terms of number the uh, students or learning aspect in the park, so if number students target for now, majorly students on the end with my categories for now, only students are getting developed for uh, information technology in so long, you know, on the OT in so long, IT and OT in so long. So if a mechanical, triple E, easy, other than the operational technologies and the categories in a row. So I'm going to have a number of block based robot programming up in the very number so little. So it is simple, they have the programming knowledge, but they wanted to operate the robot, they have the block based. Whereas even in IT, CSE background, cyber security, AI, DS and AI, ML students, so they all have Python scripting, C, C++. And the industrial Doosan Cobot, it has all the features, so custom based API programming can be run, one of the best features on the robot. And this is a reason that is highly developed by Robot Operating System, ROS. So it's an open source platform, so we can control the robot. So we have different trainings for the different segment of students. We can open the subject in this subject. So if you are interested in the subject, you can learn the robot. You can learn the subject of agriculture and engineering, but you can learn how the robot works. They will take this subject as a course. Hello sir, what are you doing in the centers of excellence in the centers of excellence? What are you doing in the centers of excellence? It is a distributed ledger for having the distributed security transactions. That's why. Then, you can have the rental agreement. For example, you have to buy a stamp paper and then both the tenant as well as the owner of the house has to sign the agreement and it has to be submitted, right? So this is uh, what the rental agreement is all about. Coming to the e-governance, so when government want to do something uh, very quickly, so what it can be done is in the blockchain, we can have the concept called as a smart contract. The smart contract, which it is number immediate, uh, will, it is possible for you to have the tenant as well as the owner to sign an agreement in an e-governance way, right? So, that's one of the main applications. In this case, there are many applications. That's why you can execute the distributed transactions. You can execute the blockchain. Center of Excellence Blockchain in Savita Engineering College la, nama enna soli kudukro na. We are having a Ubuntu as the platform and we have the Ethereum as the platform over that. Ethereum gredo or blockchain platform, umlo kelar kun teriyo. Bitcoin la Ethereum is a popular Bitcoin. So adale andha platform use pani kko. So aduk base adu base pani the students will be able to generate keys and all those things. Okay, so it is a security keys engre da umga understand pani panga. Then it is possible for them to develop a distributed application which is called as a DAPS. DAPS in Solid Panga. So Remix ID is used it. They will be able to develop the blockchain applications on the Remix ID. We are addressing to the students for cyber security. CSE cyber security is a core paper. So other departments are an elective paper. 